Let's start with the seven deadly sins, since everyone and their mother is basing characters on them. There are like 11 or 12 or 18 different endings. Most of these metaphors are bullshit, especially this one. Oh my god, they're civilians. Sakurai fucking woke up in a crop circle with the name Kirby carved into his arm. The Bookman's Bluff. It's when an author creates something and people are like, hey, that doesn't make sense. But then the author says, well, it does make sense if you consider it's actually a metaphor. Once you got that boy under your possession, time to get real into unethical science. Once you got that boy under your possession, time to get real into unethical science. We see Kirby piloting mechs, and if anime is to be believed, and I believe anime, this can only be accomplished by gifted teens grappling with psychosexual ennui. We see Kirby piloting mechs, and if anime is to be believed, and I believe anime, this can only be accomplished by gifted teens grappling with psychosexual ennui. We see Kirby piloting mechs, and if anime is to be believed, and I believe anime, this can only be accomplished by gifted teens grappling with psychosexual ennui. I literally have no clue how this dumb fucking orb can have so much power. I literally have no clue how this dumb fucking orb can have so much power. And then it's another existential crisis, but this is my favorite one. They Turns out she's dead. Turns out she's dead. Turns out she's dead. Turns out she's dead. Who doesn't love a little erratic lizard fiction? Ooh, come on, baby. Toddlers are more communicative. Cats the musical, but with more guns and a better plotline. Violation, violation, violation. This cute fire puppy, isn't that- Oh God! Oh no, 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 no! Please get no! Oh no, 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 cute, I'm okay. And now that you're jazzed and ready to go, time to fail. I lulled you into a false sense of security. Ugh, history's so boring. I'm done with this. I couldn't give a shit about death. I do not feel at all qualified to discuss the philosophical implications of that the desolation of working at a job. Let's do the child one. Dumb 35 year old man who lives in his parents house and then he gets sucked into a book and then he goes into Tingle's land because we all know the true monster is man. And cannibalism is frowned upon in news. Also pretty good at figure skating. That's science bait. But how many frames does a gamer game in the game frame mainframes? And also you have to have exits that don't involve plummeting to your death. Ooh, look at Gordon Ramsay over here making warm milk. Develop an organization to trick young boy into committing heartless genocide in order to create a new pseudo version of that great power you discovered back in stage three. And then you fail again, because God has cursed me for my hubris and my work is never finished. Hey bucko, I think what you don't understand is basic storytelling. Basic storytelling.